Good afternoon, everybody. This is Tommy from outside our lane. Me and Dustin's at the Nook plant this afternoon, Friday afternoon, uh, January the something. I'm not sure what it is. Finally made over here to the booms, the nuke plant. I'm gonna start off with gotch plug. I've never thrown a gotch plug in fresh water, but why not? Looks like something striper might might want to hit. That'll change. It's on a gotch on 12 pound mono. Well, I was touch on 12 pound model. Had my line loop there a second ago. When I went to cast, it got bound up somehow. And I think I got your plug off. I don't know where it went. It went a long ways. A very long ways. Anyway, we're going to retie this. Got a bunch of salt water baits with me that I already had in my box. I'm just gonna try some of them. This is a finger mullet here. It's tough the last time I was out here. Down. Down the zipper. Give her a second to get down a little bit. Really don't think I've got enough weight. I think I'd be better off on top than where I'm at in the water column. Alright, we're gonna change out again. There we go. Destin zone. I am back turned. I was there. We go. That's what we're after. Oh man, that was a really big skipjack. I like to get a bunch of them too. Okay. He's hammering it like a striper. I thought it was a striper. Even when you had him right there, he was so thick bodied. Hitting like hitting like a small fish. That's a yellow bass. Another YouTuber I watch all the time, Colin J, got a Conway. He was over here just a couple of days ago and he was catching some huge yellow bass. I mean, some they look like they're half pound almost. Which ain't a big fish, but for yellow bass, that's a pretty decent sized fish. Dustin's got another hookup. Told him I got a, I got a rod set up already. I'll chunk him out here back to back. Do you? Yeah. Throw him out the back. It's that uh, big big. Well, I mean, I'm not gonna eat shad, but he what shad produce. I switched baits a couple of times. Now I've got a couple Bobby Garland baits on. 
trying to catch a fish. I don't care what it is. All right, we made a move again. We're, we're here. He's trying to catch a fish of any kind. We don't care. Just something. It don't feel like a giant. The pole was a leaving though. So the pole was a leaving though. Drum. Mr. Drum. That's fun anyway. Mr. Drum? Sorry buddy, this is not your day. You would typically get thrown back. You you bet the wrong bait. <laughs> yeah. You're now the star of the show, buddy. <laughs> Besides the vendors, we keep snagging. <laughs> yeah. It's a, sad, it's a sad day when we're targeting drum. Oh, well, I don't care. I think at this point it's uh, whatever lights. Yeah. Something. Oh, that's a way. <laughs> I actually thought it was a striper the way the pole was leaving there for a minute. <laughs> Me too. <laughs> you said, Tommy Dale? <laughs> Give us a little slack this time. <laughs> well, maybe. We just had a video. <laughs> Give us a little bit of excitement anyway. I didn't have it on a while ago when I broke off on that one. Oh. Little diamond jig will come right through them shag without scaring them. Yep. Another skipjack. I call Eli and tell him skipjack her and he'll come down here. What I need to do, because skipjack don't freeze well, yeah. I need to go ahead and get some hooks and, and embed in the pieces and freeze them like that. Leave them frozen and get down there and take them out and put them on the line frozen and cast them out. That's a good one. Yeah, that is. <laughs> Months and a half to come out here and catch more skipjack. Hey, my body's not responding like it was before. On it. What I think it is? Big skipjack. Skip no! Oh. <laughs> he hammered it. No, I don't know. Uh, I've seen that. I don't know if that's fishing into my line or a bite. I think it's shattered into it. Was that you or me? I guess we'll have to get back up here that way, both of them. You see that little shattered? Yeah. That's a bite. I don't think it's anything very big.
Ah, ouais. Ouais, ouais. Let's see if we can get another. Always one more. There's something out there. We got a fish. You got a fish on? Yep. <laughs> it's moving weird. It don't feel like a giant, but it's it's not you know tiny or nothing. He might not know he was caught. Oh, that's wild. Is that a buffalo? That's a drum. That's a good size drum. That's good for a. There's our catch and cook, boys and girls. That's a good drum there. Oh, he's not hooked very good. Where's that net at? Uh, I think Dad took it out. We had this conversation. Oh no! Cold. He may sit still. Yay! <laughs> I don't even think he knew he was caught, Tommy Dale. <laughs> he did either. I think he drunk. Well, that's enough for a catch and cook anyway. Tommy Dale. And drum are delicious, so. You, you want to try one more? No. Sure? No, Dustin. <laughs> <laughs> well. We didn't catch a whole lot of fish, but that was fun. Yeah. Well, we're done for the evening. We didn't catch a whole lot of fish, but we caught a few. We didn't catch a stripper. That's what we came over after cropping, either one of those. Uh, but we did catch fish to have a catch and cook with. I caught a couple good drum. They're just as tasty as any of the rest of them. Not a, all the desirable list for a lot of folks, but I don't mind them much. Uh, there's my partner in crime for the day. It's cold, y'all. It is cold. <laughs> I don't know why you didn't wear this other pair of gloves I had. You never told me about it. Oh, I guess I should have told you about those. <laughs> <laughs> this is the Rockies. <laughs> All right. It's been another from outside our lane. Catch you later. Like and subscribe. We'll see you on the next one.